and uh, we started our campaigns you know immediately because for so long uh madare has been you know has been looking and hoping and praying for an mp that you know is born uh raised who has been brought up in madare someone that understands the people of madare and that's why uh on this uh press conference i i decided to have two representatives from from madare because i am not a visitor in madare uh before kenya knew me madare was my first fan base and uh I've been working with Madare for so long, you know, doing projects, feeding projects with a small I am from the music. And you know, my mother's here. They sat me down and and told me they needed a leader that comes from Madare because Madare for so long has not been benefiting uh from the governance especially from the member of parliament that is currently in madare and even after the celebration when i got the certificate uh for the last 24 hours uh it has been one of the hardest you know times of my my life because i've been thinking of how i'll put this out not to look as if i am you know i am betraying my fellow youth and not to look as if i'm betraying the people of madare that have entrusted me with this opportunity you know and the people of madare are the same same people that pushed for my nomination because for the last 3 weeks since i announced as a member of parliament i have been leading in almost all opinion polls not not only as a as a candidate in jubilee but overall according to the current opinion polls by mizani and the current government opinion polls i've been leading and i've been ahead even ahead of the sitting mp because he has not served the people but now I received a call uh and I I I was called for a meeting and I I want to be as open as possible that I'm being told I need to recall the certificate. Uh and step down for the sitting MP. Because he is threatened and he feels like if i am in the ballot the seat will not go back to odm which i have said no
and I call this press just to talk to m to my president. I also want to talk to to Honorable Raila Amolo Odinga. I am also in Azimio. And this certificate here is not only for Bahati. This certificate represents many other youths. This is a sign of hope. I respect you, my president, and I respect Honorable Raila Amolo Oding. But please, give the youth of this country a chance. I know there is zoning and Madare has been zoned as an ODM area. But for this one time, give the youth of this country a chance. Give the people of Mathare a chance to get the leader they have always wanted. I, I want to state that in a very humble way, <laughs> that, you know, Mr. President, my party leader, Uhuru Mwegai Kinyata, to the fifth, Raila Amolo Ding, I will not lie to you. These people of Madare have suffered for so long. I did not come to politics because I wanted a job. I already had one. But these people of Madare want someone that can understand their problems.